They said ballistic missiles, and that, that got to me 100%. The first time that I ever came down here to the dock, I saw the submarine. I think the craziest thing was how big it was. So as a missile tech, you're in charge of the safety, security, and maintenance of the Trident 2 D5 missile. Since we work on the nuclear weapon system, it takes a lot of trust. It's not really like sit at a desk kind of job. We're in charge of not only the weapons, but also the entire weapon system. Every valve and component that is associated with the weapon system, we are in charge of. Come on, weapons. Weapon system ready. Launcher, do not pressurize. We do a lot of training underway. We do a lot of drills. The most enjoyable thing about my job now is uh, actually doing countdowns. You get to play around with a lot of different systems, hydraulic systems, uh, high pressure systems. A big portion of our job is also a lot of electrical work. You're learning about the ship itself. When the missile leaves the platform, uh, the ship becomes more buoyant based off the lost weight of the missile. So we have systems in place that are able to rapidly bring on water in place of the missile that was just launched. A bolt might break, something might rupture, something electrical might overheat, break out. So it was a big learning experience in order to be able to combat those types of casualties. Restore all casualties, count up inside. Computer, automatic pronounce to the cabin. Automatic pronounce to the cabin, time. You're essentially holding the man next to you's life in your hands in case any casualty happens. I guess that makes it such a small, very bonding community. I don't really know how you'd have nuclear missiles without missile technicians. That's why I like being a missile tech. I know if I'm a missile tech, I gotta keep my family safe back home. <laughs>